Okay, hi guys, so single arm row, uh, using a kettlebell or a dumbbell, but instead of having ourselves on a bench for support, uh, we're actually going to use you know, our own sort of strength and the leg structure to try and hold ourselves upright. So it's a bit more challenging in terms of uh, you know, core stability, uh, so it's a bit trickier to learn. However, obviously, because it's a bit more technical, a bit more skill going involved, it does give us sort of better return um, in terms of what we're going to learn and help. See, do some core work at the same time we're doing a row. So it is tricky to learn, but it gives you more benefit. Okay, so I'm gonna use a, a kettlebell for me. So a lot of it really is getting your, your weight set. So what I see a lot of people doing is they have this sort of back leg straight and they kind of push themselves over here like this. So just off balance the whole time, which is obviously no good because all the weight is on your front leg. So what we wanna do is have the rear foot, so we come up onto ball your foot, or you can turn your foot out a little bit. And then from here, just sort of sink your weight down. You should feel the weight's kind of in your hamstrings and your glutes. It's just sort of nice and set. And then we can just use your hand here for a bit of support. We don't feel that like we're kind of off balance the whole time. Okay. So with the weight, I come in here, set in. I'm setting my weight's back. I'm not forward, I'm back into it. And then when I row, I'm coming in almost towards my belly, where my belly button is. Yeah, like that and squeeze. So when I'm rowing, I'm not kind of chewing myself up like this. I'm almost anything, almost like anti-shrug. Putting the shoulder down towards the hip as I row back. So I feel that lat kick in here and down. So I row, I'm here. So I feel my lat kick in as I come in each time. Squeeze and down, squeeze and down. So make sure you're not too upright and make sure you're not trying to like sort of chicken wing it up. Just from here, nice straight back, put a brace on. Squeeze, squeeze, and in like that. So it's not too hard once you've got it, but you get that setup correct. And again, you should really feel like your lats working. You're not trying to chew your shoulder up. Keep it a brace and squeeze through. You should feel there's a lot of weight, so in that support leg here in the front, in my glute, in my hamstring, and a bit of core as well. But again, practice the position. Take your time, get it right, and just keep checking yourself. Maybe if you need to check yourself in the mirror for position, that can help. Again, get that position correct. And remember the aim of the exercise is keep your shoulders pulled down and squeeze back through so you feel the lat kicking in. 